Just putting money into the equation is not necessarily this corrupting, horrible thing. You're paying somebody for doing some work. Yeah. That's, how, that's what happens in America all the time. Okay, let me let Len let respond to that. Well, take a, look at, take a look at the factors we're talking about when it comes to these young basketball and football players. How they were raised with regard to being an AAU teams, being um, coddled in many ways, not really understanding. People, coaches complain about that all the time, that they don't have uh, the necessary understanding of what real life is all about. And it continues in college. Um, the point being made, and, and you want to use anecdotes, I'll use one. Cardale Jones from Ohio State, the quarterback, immediately when he would read before the draft, they asked him about his stay at Ohio State. He says, man, you know, I wasn't there to, I, I was there to play football. I wasn't there to play school. And then after he goes to the Buffalo Bills, Real life smacked him in the face. All of a sudden now, education is very important. I think it's the most important thing of all. So if we're going to use anecdotes, he's not the only one, I guarantee you, to be able to say that. And, and that's the bottom line. It comes down to distraction. You know, I, I only got paid $15 a month. That was what the NCAA allowed. And, you know, so we didn't have those distractions. I'm sure you didn't have that distraction because you knew you had to work. You knew you had to study. But when these kids come to school, they think, and I did too, that you're there to play ball. Well, how would Cardale the, be any more distracted than he was if he was getting paid? He wasn't even getting paid and he was distracted. I mean, you, uh, no, I didn't, how, say, how I didn't money, say he was. How would money change? I didn't it? say he was distracted. He just said he was there to play football. That's not distraction, mm. that's apathy. That's a whole different story. Well, and that's what we're we fighting. Can, we can answer that. We can actually answer that in one line. You let the athletes take one or two classes a semester instead of five. That's part of the problem. And you give them a lifetime scholarship so that when life whacks, whacks them in the face, they can come back in 10 years and get their, get their degree. Solved. Problem solved. Yeah.